Hey guys, it's Phone Rena. Today we're doing a quick unboxing of the Motorola Atrix 4G. We just got in, got in our review unit. It's going to do a quick uh, brief tour of the device. Packaging, of course, is pretty much typical of any other device nowadays. It's fairly small, not that large, not that not that large at all. Uh, so we open up. We've got the Motorola Atrix 4G, which we first got the opportunity of checking out back at CES. This is the final product right here. So we'll go a little bit more. Um, just talk about it a little bit more later. Uh, let's put that away right here. The other stuff included with the packaging, of course, you have the quick start guide. You have the wall charger, which one end is plus the wall. The other one is the USB port for the um, for the micro USB cable that's included with the packaging. And the neat thing about it, too, is that it includes the micro HDMI cable as well, which is not something you see necessarily coming along with most smartphones nowadays. Uh, you usually have to buy that separately. And another impressive thing is that it pack, it's packed along with a 1930 milliamp hour battery, so it's a fairly large size. So uh, let's just pop, pop this in. I'm going to take a look and see. Uh, uh, we'll talk about a little bit more about the uh, Atrix 4G here and some of its hardware. It has actually a lot of impressive stuff going on with it. So uh, opening it up, you just got to just open up from the bottom, I believe. There's a notch right there, and you can just hold on to it and it opens up just like that. You have the slot for the battery here, it's some card slot, micro SD card slot as well. And just slide in the battery like that, close it up. It's a plastic back cover, so it's kind of kind of flimsy a little bit, but it snaps into place. And as you notice, as you're powering it on, you see it's, it says there dual core, dual core technology. That's because uh, the Atrix 4G is dubbed as the world's smartest, uh, world's fastest smartphone. So that's a pretty impressive title there. It's packing actually the uh, one gigahertz dual core Nvidia Tegra 2 processor in there, so it should make the the handset fly. The other thing, other thing about it, um, it also has a four inch. Q QHD display and the resolution of that's actually 540 by 960. So it should offer some crisp visuals uh, once it's powered on here. Um, let's take a look and see what else is on the sides. Left hand side, you have just it looks like the micro USB port there, and also the HDMI port. You have your touch, your capacitive buttons on the front, your typical Android ones. A front facing 0.3 megapixel v VGA camera. The earpiece itself, you have the, sen the light and proximity sensors on top there as well. Right hand side, you just have the volume rocker. The back, you have notch here for a speaker, the speakerphone. 5 megapixel autofocus camera with dual LED flash. And on top, you have 3.5mm headset jack. And it's an interesting placement with the power button. The dedicated power button is placed towards the middle, but it's at, towards the back, which, uh, which kind of feels good too, just um, using it. So let's, uh, let's launch this here. Now, the uh, Atrix 4G. Um, it's available right now through AT&T, and uh, it's actually uh, powered by, it's running Android 2.2 Froyo with uh, the customized version of uh, Motoblur running on top of it. And just navigating around it, it should be pretty, it's pretty smooth, obviously with the uh, dual core processor in tow. So it's looking like a pretty neat thing. Um, some people will like Motoblur, some people might not, but hey, you know, it just depends on your taste. And the neat thing about the Atrix 4G is just the connectivity options uh, available to it. You have the uh, laptop dock that you connect with the device. It adds just a little bit more functionality, which we'll show you in a later on in a future video here. Uh, but that's pretty much it, guys. So uh, check back. You can look at our website, phonerena.com, for more information on the uh, Motorola Atrix 4G. And we should have a review up very shortly.